had the sun rising with your hike to the summit. Not a lot of people get to do that. There's the physical challenge to it, but there's also sort of the emotional, spiritual side. It's restorative. Breathe and run around with the dogs and put on some snowshoes or go out and ski and get some fantastic runs in. There's more space to get out and explore. There's less people. You feel like you're in the middle of nowhere. Carving those first turns just doesn't hurt. I feel incredibly fortunate to have the customers that we have. They're also very interesting. They have interesting stories to tell about how they've come to be in Vermont. They just fell in love with the type of life that you can live here. And so I think we share a commonality in that way. At some point, I'm going to get to work today. In society, we've sort of gotten to a place where we just do things. I throw the coin in the thing, go through the toll, get to the thing, get to the meeting, get on the plane, get to the place, get the food, pay the bill, get to the thing, get to the thing. And it's like, what would it be like if we could just slow that process down a little bit and not be looking for the very next thing to do, but take this very thing that we're doing and get the absolute most out of it. Everybody's looking for that moment to relax, you know, that moment to just kind of be. We are not everything to everybody either. You know, we aren't looking to sell anything just to sell something. It's really what goes on in the passion of the purchase and the reasons and the relationship behind it. That's the real lasting value. I was buying a piece yeah. of jewelry to celebrate Beth surviving cancer. Every time I look at it, it means a lot. I met my wife here at the end of the first season. I ask uh, Wendy if she wants to go up the mountain with me in the morning. She said, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So we went up to the top, and from there, we walked over to the fire tower. It was cold, and it was very crisp and beautiful, but definitely made an impression on her. Well, it's, you know, it's kind of uh, that corny a little bit, but it's, you know, it's kind of magical. It's gorgeous. We care about people, we care about the land, you know, Vermont is such a beautiful place. You hear those sirens? Oh no, nope, you don't. It always makes you feel that you are alive. 